Okay, everyone, settle down, settle down. Thank you. I'm here to announce Owner's Box commitment to nut shaving technology. I'd like to thank everyone who recruited me, the old razor and the beard trimmer, but I'm going to be taking my talents to Manscaped for our nut cutting season. 20% off at manscaped.com with promo code BOX and free shipping worldwide. Once again, 20% off and free shipping worldwide with promo code BOX. Get it today. Welcome back to Am I the Asshole presented by Owner's Box Weekly Fantasy Sports where we take one question from the internet and we're just going to determine whether or not you're an asshole. Jer, are you back there? Nope. No, Jer's not back there. Jer's not here. I don't know the people on the set. That's that's <laughs> tough. Avery, what do people need to do? If like, comment, subscribe, watch the videos. This is going to be one of our later videos. Go watch them all. Yes, every single one. Title for this one. Am I the asshole for losing a client while on vacation? I know what Avery's answer is to this question. I don't know I if, I, it. if I've formulated it yet. All right. Anyways, my husband and I took a much needed vacation to the beach last week and the entire week before we left, I sent emails around letting everyone know I'd be completely inaccessible for the week so to come and see me for any work materials needed. I gave everything, I gave everyone everything I knew or thought they need and left confident that everyone had prepared themselves seeing as I'd given them eight days to prepare. When I returned, I found chaos in the office. Probably <laughs> an overreaction. Yeah, <laughs> you're, sure. one, you're one salesperson or whatever your job is. Uh, apparently, one of my colleagues had needed files for a particularly important client of ours and had not been able to find them in my office, and I never responded to calls or emails, as I warned I would, wouldn't do. This coworker knew they'd been handling this client and had eight days and 12 hours a day to ask me for all pertinent files and appears to have not. In any case, I was blamed because the client is technically mine and I am supervisor of this coworker. I contend that I'm blameless because this coworker had eight days to co collect all their files like their other coworkers did and they neglected to do so. No one seems to care <laughs> about that. Am I the asshole? I know my answer too. Go ahead, Avery. Well, okay. I'm, I like to throw things off a little bit. I like to push things back. So if yeah. you tell me I have eight days to do something, I'm going to wait till the last day, like yeah. no matter what. And this person's in the same boat. You're like, you don't think you need things till you need them, right? Mm -hmm. So if you don't do the work before, you're fucked. Yep. That's exactly what, they put them in this boat. This person's obviously the boss. They gave them all the materials necessary, but come on, you just gotta be low on time here. So to me, this person's a bit of an asshole because the boss. The boss, yeah. Because they, they definitely had calls. Like, you don't have to check your emails, whatever, that's fine. But if people are calling you and they called you, like, let's say they called you every day a few times a day and you just never answered, you're a bit of an asshole. Like, yeah, yeah we get it. You want to be away from the office. You want some time off. But, like, it's not like life shuts down yeah, when your job nothing has to else matters. Suck if you're totally offline. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. That's what do you true. think this person does for a job? I like, I like asking. Got a lot of <laughs> files and stuff. Seems like a pretty boring job. But like accounting, maybe. What about like law Lawyers? stuff? Yeah. If you're a lawyer, this is tough. A accounting or law would make sense to me. Accounting One from hating their job, from hating their job <laughs> to from there's like file the, the whole files and what have you. To but access. it seems like they are getting shit on appropriately. The boss here, because yeah. they said, "Oh, I gave them every reason to," and no one seems to admit that that the other person's in the wrong. He's responsible for that uh, coworker, and he can't just say he's blameless and that guy messes up. I, mean, I love the idea of you just got 15 missed calls. You're like, no, I'm on yeah, VK. Like, that makes no sense. It. From the yeah. same person. They are on vacation, though. Like, I can see their side. They told, they said they get eight days and 12 hours a day, right? Yeah, well, while they were while they were still, still in, in the office. Like, I get they had time to prep for that, too, but they are on vacation. I wanted to see if anyone, if anyone agrees with that. Agrees with, with what? With what Gavin's saying, like. Technically, they are on they, vacation. They said I'm True. unavailable. You shouldn't, you shouldn't be blamed for it. Like, yeah. maybe not accountable, but, like, I think they could have definitely done a better job. But you are on vacation. Like People know you. Sh like, it wasn't a surprise to anyone that they didn't answer any of the calls, right? I think nah, it had to have been. Know. Had to have been. I, so I, 15 is fucking a lot of missed calls. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. nobody said, yeah, nobody said, they didn't say how many calls it was, but oh, this is uh, a personal situation of a job that I was at before I was here where after I've left, people have like sent me a message <laughs> to ask me about a client and like, I'll help, like I'll help them or a client is, doesn't know I've left and they've messaged me and I've made sure that they're like taken care of or, or in contact with the right person. It's like, you know, there's just like the common courtesy of like, let's just not fuck everybody over. Yeah. If the client was so important, they would have been able to answer their phone for this missed call. 
if there's also 15 yeah. missed calls, there's definitely voicemails in there, and he's definitely just ignoring all the voicemails and just saying, it's not my problem. So he's a bit of an asshole. Do you think this is a guy or a girl? Did it say? I don't think it said. <laughs> I don't think it said. It said my husband, so it's a girl. Okay. Oh, that's what I thought. oh yeah, She's true. Yes, it did say my husband. Anyways. I don't know. So is it, do you think it was an intern who fucked this up? Yeah, like it was definitely someone who works for her. Yeah, so someone they she probably hired is the reason for her downfall now. So that's on that's yeah. on the people you hire, right? That it reflects back on you. Back on you, yeah. Fuck, that's a tough look. That's true. She gets to hold this against this intern that didn't have the information, but at the end of the day, she's kind of held accountable regardless of vacation. And good thing they're going back to college in a couple of weeks. Probably. Yeah, you are. So. <laughs> I hope they're an intern. Out of sight, out of mind. No, promo- <laughs> no promotion for this for this uh, constituent, fellow constituent. Nope. Anyways, Cole, asshole, not an asshole? Uh, I'd probably go, like, tough on the intern, but I think this lady's an asshole. Drew? I'm going to go asshole. Avery? Not an asshole. Gavin? Not an asshole. They're on vacation. That's, I can't believe, I'm, I'm deciding, I'm, she's an asshole just because, like, Work has to be at least somewhat part of your life. It's yeah. not just work. So you, like you sit down yeah, in bed doing people, nothing. You assign that to someone else. I know. I know what you're. I agree. I, think I wanted someone both to say this. Kind of being assholes, to be honest. Like the office is and and her. Well, she shouldn't. The people that are being assholes in the situation are the ones blaming the person for it, not the intern blaming the boss for losing. Doesn't seem like client. an overall great yeah. culture at that workplace. I would say it is very destructive <laughs> yeah, culture. Yeah, right, chaotic, destructive. Anyways, uh, drop a comment below. Did you say your answer? Yeah, I said I said she's na- like I said yeah that she's an asshole. Unfortunately, okay. she's like your your work, your work is part of your life. It's not just work. It should probably be intertwined with your life. Like that. Anyways, drop a comment. Let us know what you think. Like if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel, of course. And we'll see you next time.